many shelters like Union Mission Ministries are already at capacity. You can see the snow is coming down behind me. Temperatures are dropping and this is the time where people start to look for a place to sleep tonight. More and more people are calling looking for shelter. Union Mission Ministries Linda Jones says the shelter can't take in any more people. We're at capacity. We have uh, almost 400 people uh, in our shelters every night. And without state and federal funding, they need help with shortages. Our needs tend to rise, not just with the amount of people, but the we have to feed them. So we have a, always have a great need for food. Hilberto Williams was homeless, and now he volunteers with the mission handing out food. Go and feed the poor, you know, those are their needs, you know, and that's my, you know, that's my job. Oh, they used to serve me before, but I, you know, I have to continue serving. And members like Minyard Davis depend on this kind of help every day. Get the assistance that you need, um, you know, get to get a, a Christian message, um, you know, be able to, to make roots. Asher Blackson went to the mission during last week's snowstorm, and he's been there ever since. It's the one two inches I can live with, but, over, but it's over a foot of snow? No, no. And he hopes to stay a little longer. I, I love it here. I love it here. It's better than me out in the cold. Now, the mission is open 24-7, and they need food, blankets, even time if you can volunteer. And all that information is on 13newsnow.com. Megan Perrier, 13 News Now.